Hey guys, welcome back to the Getting Started tutorial series. In this lesson, we're going to cover how to order securities on Quantopian. There are several different functions in the Quantopian API that allow you to place orders, but we're going to focus on the order target percent function. Order target percent allows us to order a security to a target percent of our portfolio value, which can involve opening a new position, readjusting a position that we already have, or even closing a position depending on the state of our portfolio as well as the target that we specify. In this context, the portfolio value is the sum value of all open positions plus the cash balance. As an example, say I want half my portfolio to be long in Apple, I can just type order target percent, which takes two parameters, the first one being the stock I want to order, and the second one being the target percent of my portfolio. So here I'll put my reference to the Apple security as the first parameter, and then 0.5 or 50% as the second. Since I have a $100,000 starting capital base and no open positions, this is going to order me $50,000 worth of Apple stock. Now I'm actually going to add an if statement right before this, and I'm going to write if data dot can trade, and then a reference to my security. And I'm going to cover in one of the later lessons what this actually does, but for now I'm just going to leave it in here. Now say I wanted to open a short position. Uh, it's almost the same thing. All I have to do is provide a negative value for the target percent. As an example, say I want 50% of my portfolio value to be short in the SPY ETF. I'm just going to create a reference and initialize to SPY. So context.spy equals SID and then SPY. And then back in handle data, I'm going to go if data.cantrade context.spy and then order target percent of context.spy and negative 0.5 for 50% of my portfolio value as a short position. To see what this looks like, I'm going to run a full backtest for one month. And then I'm going to go to the Transaction History tab and see the orders that were placed. So now that I'm in the full backtest window, I'm going to go to the Transaction Details tab. And I can see the two $50,000 orders being placed at the beginning of my simulation. But then I see all these very small orders being placed almost every minute after that. What's happening here is our portfolio value as well as the prices for Apple and SPY are fluctuating each minute. So the number of shares that are needed to make up 50% of our portfolio value is changing. And since order target percent is being called each minute, it's adjusting our positions to reflect this. The other order functions work similar to order target percent, and you can read more about them in the help docs.